Weekend is here, and that means it's time to catch some Friday flicks at seven feet one. <laughs> Gotta give him that in. Shaquille O'Neal takes on everything he does in a big way, and he's doing just that in the new comedy Uncle Drew. That's right. The film stars Kyrie Irving as a legendary basketball star who's asked to put together a team of his old cronies. CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo sat down with Shaq himself recently to talk about the film and, of course, his South Florida roots. Someone like you could combine the old school with the new school at the Rocker. I'll do it on one condition. Anything you want. It's got to be my team, my roster. It's a reunion of old souls on the basketball court, literally in the new comedy Uncle Drew. After a series of setbacks, a young man named Dax recruits a basketball legend named Uncle Drew, played by NBA All-Star Kyrie Irving, who puts together a squad of old pros to win the Rucker Classic, a famous Harlem tournament. It's septuagenarians versus the young ones for a $100,000 prize. Shaquille O'Neal plays the appropriately named Big Fella, a former basketball Hall of Famer who's now a Kung Fu instructor. In addition to Shaq and Irving, there's a slew of famous players that include Chris Webber, Reggie Miller, and Lisa Leslie. How much fun was it getting together with these guys? Uh, once we uh, got on the court and got back into basketball mode, we just, it's just about bringing up old stories. But once we played against the other people, then the, the competitive juices start to kick in. Like, people always ask me, can I dunk? And I say, what do you think? So then I'll be like, all right, what you want to bet? Well, I bet you uh, I'll buy you lunch. <laughs> Throw it down, nasty jam, get free lunch. I, I get around 25-year-olds, and I think I'm one of them too, right? It's oh, just how we are. You look 25. Oh, yes, I love girl. you, Shaq. No, you look fabulous. You These days, O'Neal calls South Florida home again. I live, I live in Fort Lauderdale. Yes, he's back after those winning years, namely the NBA championship with the Miami Heat in 2006. Shaq made his mark in this town in many ways. Yeah. And so I remember the day when you were working with the police force. Is that still a part of your life? Yes, in... yes ma'am. How much do you do that? A lot. I'm undercover, so I really can't talk about it. <laughs> True. Really? Yes. Yeah, under the radar. Under the radar. So you had moves other than on the basketball court. I feel like I could get up with you right now and start dancing. You got the moves. Always had them? Yeah, I was, uh, before I was a great basketball player, I was a great break dancer. So I, used to, I actually used to get in trouble as a youth for break dancing in the middle of the class. So, I've, uh, you know, it's just like riding a bike. Once you, once you have it, it never leaves you. Well, it never leaves you for sure. I'm going to try to sing it how they do. Uncle Drew opens in theaters this week. I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News. That was nice.